Hello everyone, I'm here with the Hammer Game Channel and welcome back to Fury Rank. We're in the last episode. We we started pushing forwards in Africa as um, the UK declared war on France, which has put us at war with the Continental Entente, the Continental Alliance, or whatever the hell it is, and why are offensive lines causing the game to break? How glorious. Thank you. That'll do, I guess. Actually, no, it won't. I'm not, I'm not satisfi satisfied one bit. I'm not even, What on earth is that? Just work for me, please. Ah, oh, stuff it. We don't need one down there anyways. We're pushing quite nicely into Italian Libya. Which I'm hoping we can actually secure with six divisions. Would be a very interesting development. The thing is, though, the Italians and the French are not that great because of their uh, manpower issues. But the UK is about to lose, well, all those divisions. You absolute nimrod. We're doing amazingly well. We should get our independence this episode as well. Oh, yes, finally. More economy. Great. We can also go to the limited regulated markets. We'll do that as well. That should help us out, maybe. Oh, it does. We've got eight steel. Still need to trade for some. Right, let's do a total war. Get rid of that, because that decision's broken, of course. It's a segregation one. Let's push in there. Gotta push across. You as well. Bengasi is a great little foot to push to. I do hope that we can actually push forward there as well. So this guy's coming along. Sort of secure another port. Oh, did our division make any? No, it looks like they did not make any progress over the river here. I'm hoping I get across the river here, and then we can start pushing around and down, because we're not going to be able to push across here. This is a pretty heavily defended area now. So yeah, the UK is there in abundance, so... How about we just move to here, divisions? The UK should manage that. If not, they're idiots. Then again, they did absolute balls up this because they were doing so well and then decided to abandon it for whatever reason. Oh, again, we've got ourselves another very nice in, um, encirclement. Continue our push up to Tripoli now. These guys should have this covered. Go back to the Reds. They still weren't able to push in there. That's fine, because we should be able to push for the Belgians this way. Just need to give them a little bit of time to get some organisation, so we'll focus back on you. Uh, oh yes, Poland and Lithuania joined the, um, the style pack last episode and basically just said, bugger off to the rest of the Intermarium, which now consists of Hungary, Romania, and Latvia. Oh yes, of course, we've got the Swedish... People's Front, rather. Three convoys. Thank you. Of course, the Russians are also at war with the Russian Republic now, as well as Japan, because Japan was guaranteeing them. Saying that with the Kingdom of Poland. Poland will just be safeguarding their future by joining the Germans now. Although I've seen that we've joined them and thought, oh no, we better actually join them. Because we could be in bother here. Yeah, see when you're not crossing. Oh, well, we are actually crossing a river there. See when you're not crossing this river, though? Oh, we're fine. There's five French divisions down here. So if we can blast through here, maybe even push and link up with the, uh, the UK over here, then we could get an encirclement, crush the encirclement up here and then down here. It's a decent amount of troops we'd get from that. We're still doing very well pushing forward here. I think the Romanians are actually aiding the Italians, though. They are indeed. Romania is aiding basically everybody they can send trips to. In the continental entente. Still not really being much use whatsoever as we are continuing to push forward with the UK here. Which is good. I feel like Germany's maybe actually recovering slightly now. Then again, the French and Italians, economy and army are just collapsing from exhaustion. 
Or have you got a supply issue going on? Is just attrition? No, it is a supply issue, but hopefully one that will be rectified soon. Ethiopia looks so, so out of place now. They're surrounded on all sides by the UK. Oh, Italy and Libya is going to be dying soon. Oh, we've actually um, secured Syria, which is good. Um, anyway, just if we can secure Africa, then I can hopefully head out to Europe and aid the, uh, the UK and the Germans that way by actually getting some troops in the ground. Gosh, our divisions are actually having a fantastic time. Independence is only 361 away. Um, modified land leads. We've got another 161 here. Go ahead and send them the convoys. Do we have any more planes? I'm going to send them um, 100 of these. Let's do nothing. So we want stuff that's uh, support equipment. 450? It's not bad, it's not bad. Da, 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 da. That'll do. Just get the rest from fighting on. The UK are trying to push forward, that's fine. We are doing okay over here. We're starting to make little pushes. So I'm hoping to take some more land in the peace deal from here. Uh, these are all colonies. No way I can actually core them, which is a shame, but that's fine. Yeah, we could puppet, if we can get the Congo and puppet it as its own nation, rather than having it as a, well, as just integrated, well not integrated, but as an occupied territory, because I'd rather not have that as the case. I'd rather have them as a puppet, because of course, this is just a colony state, so. If I can puppet the Congo, that would be nice. But I don't know if you can actually puppet the African countries, we'll see, we'll see. Anyways, Tripoli is right there. Oh, it looks like we're actually going to have to stop the advancement now, sadly. It would appear that additional troops have came to halt our advancement. Which, I have to say, is about time. Um, let's stop being aggressive. And what we'll do is we'll concentrate our boys on... Um, well, pushing to Tripoli. Just because, well, we take that, then they're dead. Oh, the UK has got themselves a lot of encirclement there. Very close to cutting them off up here as well. RAF, the SAAF. South African Air Force sounds cool. Let's go ahead and get one of them set up. Well, we do already have one. Oh, do we actually have any airfields closer now? We are almost got the Gabon one. It would be actually really useful if we did secure that right now. So let's go ahead and try and secure that. Looks like we're about to get cut off, but they've cut us off here. Well, they've cut off the UK there anyways. Casualties. 365k. Jeez. Um, I'm not there on the French one. No, that's disappointing. I should be top of the Belgians, I'd like to think. No, nope, I've only killed 72.4k. How many men have I lost? 39. Ah, oh, that's not bad. Um... Should be able to push forward to Tripoli now. Aha! The airfield is mine in Gabon! Airplanes assemble. It's more air dominance over, over there. Let's merge them together. Get in there and push in. We're having a good time. We're having a good time in Africa. 90 points away. Do we have any land leases? We do. We have 171. So we really probably don't need to give them all that, but we'll do it anyways. Do we have cannons want to send us stuff? Oh, we're actually short of. Can I actually cancel you? Thank you, because I do need them. I need them, thanks. <laughs> I need them. I have plenty of guns that I could offer you, but that's that is about it. Wait, what? 
That's doing 256 itself. Oh, not monthly. Just once. Oh, Blubby has gone. I knew that was going to happen. Let me hang out. Can we, can we catch them? Actually, I don't think we will be. Oh my gosh, Japan's going after the Beijing government now. Is the Feng Shian government teaming up with them or something? Oh, in there, in there. Oh, the UK's pushed forward as well. Yes, if we can push in here. So I think it's actually going to be possible. Let's do that. We're doing down here again. It's looking good. It's looking good. It's really fancy like to be like that. We may have lost 51k, but I think we're doing good. Armenia and the Democratic Republic of Georgia have peaced out. Did Georgia lose land? Potentially could have been the outcome of that. Gosh, you know the Italian divisions are guff when our divisions are... Well, they were winning there. Trick threat of Albania has died. Very nicely done, UK. Very nicely done. Secure that so these guys are all dead. Haha, <laughs> your division's retreating that way. That is ideal. Ah, yes, we'll start putting the squeeze on these guys because they are doomed. 63 points, folks. 63 points. And then we are free. Free to do as we want. But I am sticking with the UK. We, were, we are free to do as we please in terms of our foreign policy. Um, Declaring wars, we could always refuse to join war. So that's something we, something new, isn't something new that we can do. Um, yeah, it's just an HP encirclement we've got there. Let's just kill them. And we got our six divisions in place there. Let's bin that. Oh wait, what? Oh, Chile is getting invaded. That's what's happening. The Commune of La Plata. That's what threw me off there. It's not Argentina anymore, it's La Plata. Chile is now getting invaded. I knew that was coming. Ecuador is destroying Colombia. How? How is Ecuador winning that? That's amazing. Yeah, we'll get those in position. Oh yeah, they're, they are crumbling down here in Africa. Crumbling. We can we can do it. Ladies and gentlemen. We are free. The Union of South Africa is now independent. Oh, it's a glorious day for us. Now we shall aid the UK in winning this war and then well won't be anything in life for us to do, really. Oh the UK's done another land in Belgium. War, oh, and you've you've killed them off again, and you've landed, oh, you've landed troops in Cork, and they're dead as well. Dear oh dear, UK, what are you doing to yourself? We're doing better, and we we only have twenty four divisions. I think those six are gonna have just the chill for the time being. Um. Boys here might have some more luck, but I'm, I think I'm starting to stretch them a little bit too thin, so we're going to move down. What's he saying that? Right into Dula? Boom, just get, get right in there. I just need one of the UK trips to push forward here. And then that, these guys would all be dead. We just have to secure that port. Which we are pushing into right bloody now. Ah, that is the French. The African skies. Let's go ahead and do advanced air uh, fire bases, rather. And I think we're going to be in there in a second. That's all that done. Let's go ahead and get the 
Infantry with three. Push into there. Let's push into the capital. And we'll push them out of. Um, finally, out of the Congo for once and for all. Push into that port there. The Irish Free State's dead. Okay, I thought they were winning, but well done, UK. You've managed to win that, so let's go ahead and give you all your land back. Come on, that's a complete we'll give you all. Right. There we go. Right, so that's the UK dealt with their issue at the homeland. That's fine. Well, the division's doing nothing, UK. Let's go ahead and kill them. Actually trying to push out. French Equator, Africa's capitulated. We actually got four Italian, not Italian, four troops here that might actually be able to push forward, maybe. Yeah, that, that is not budging anytime soon. The Italians have only 84 divisions max now. 198 from the French. Let's see what kind of damage we do once we finally secure Africa completely in its entirety. Libreville, if we can push into there, that will be that port gone, so they won't have anywhere to run. Which we do have those troops on their way up now. I was going to say, do you guys actually just want to come and join us here? I could do with some additional troops to help with this. A lot of Belgians. Okay, Greece is going after Bulgaria. 49 to 113 divisions. Uh, how? They must be tiny as heck. No, they can't be. Surely, that's even bigger than my army. How many, many have we lost now in this conflict? 86,000. I would love to know how much we've killed. Siam's so dealing... Oh, and the Australians actually have no... Indochina's almost gone. Australia's actually done some decent naval invasions in this playthrough. Really have. Yeah, those, those Belgians are going to be dead. Oh, we have got a cutoff here in... Um, on parts of Gamaroon... Bia Biafra? And Bamenda. Yeah, all of our troops. Divert your attention down to the south, please. We'll deal with them Belgians. And we'll probably then move up to the north and just push as one. This is the final focus we're doing in the tree. Oh, no. I was going to say they're holding. But that their holding is no longer with us. They are gone. Right, do we actually want to eat them? No, actually, we'll head north. We'll head north. French casualties now. 73,000 French dead. We have killed 3.1k of them. 17.7. 9.1k. 6.3. We're not doing too bad. 2.2. Italy, we've killed 145,000. Belgians, we've killed 161,000. Oh, we're having a glorious time here. Yep, they're on the move. Greens, how are you doing? Yeah, I'm hoping we can assist you in breaking through. Actually, do you know what? This The south is looking much more favourable than the north right now. So, bin that. We're going to get ourselves up in here and actually try and cut off these divisions and then push to Dakar Take out French West Africa, push north through Casablanca, take care of Morocco, then finally to Algiers and then to Geniz, and then we'll, we'll, be, we'll be sorted. Africa will be ours. If we go with a faction map now, it's looking nice. Oh, I'm definitely taking Madagascar in a piece deal, that's for sure. I could actually go ahead and start justifying on uh, Portugal now. Oh, we'll leave that for the time being. Tried this uh, Spanish Civil War still ongoing. Oh, there's mines in the sea. Oh, that'll be a contested crossing, won't it? 
Yeah, it is. It is. Until we take um, Suessa from Morocco. And then we'll be able to pass troops and divisions through there. Which will be fantastic. Oh, they're trying to push us over here. That's funny. On you go. Do your best. Oh, you can clearly tell that there is, like, nobody defending that. Do you want to assist in dealing with those divisions? Because it's kind of annoying me that it's still there. What are, you, what are you guys doing? Is the front not big enough for all my divisions to actually go to it? Well, if that's the case, head north. That's cool. Yep, sorry about Gera died. There were there were no no way in hell they were gonna survive that. So you could do an invest in the future. Okay. Yeah, um the French have just completely collapsed over here by the looks of things. Completely collapsed. The north is stacked, um Yeah, they they are they are collapsing over here big time. We do have those additional divisions up going up north, so we might actually be able to punch through. Well, Chile's been split quite nicely between Bolivia and La Plata. It's, it's a shame the um, Brazilians haven't joined. Could you imagine if they, the Grand Republic of Central America, see if they joined as well? Oh, round two for Georgia and Armenia. I feel like Armenia is going to come out on top. Six to 20, 10 to 20. Well, we'll see. Soviets are losing big time. Or well, the Beijing government bet the Feng Shan government, so Japan's just like, do you know what? I'll secure Manchuria now. They're not even struggling. We'll see how well it goes for them, because I did say that Sweden and Finland looked like they were going to beat the Soviets, but it never happened. Can we push to the car, please? Actually, you come there. Cut them off. There's excavation one done. Let's, let's hop back over to the infantry. And do you? I'm uh, trying so hard to break through there. We almost caught up in artillery. Guns were still absolutely fine on, just smashing. To the car, please. Or in here now. Or into the car now. <laughs> Uh, will that kill them? French West Africa could could do. Which would kind of put them in a kind of a tough spot. Um, if we can actually push down here and into Freetown, that would be a, another port gone. If we can push in there, we can actually cut them off from the access of the other port. Uh, are we all up in the north? We are looking good. How, how good are the divisions? That is the question. There is 12 here. French West Africa has died. We're never going to beat that lot. We won in the north, though. Wow, that, that is hilarious. Gosh, we might actually be able to encircle these. Let's give all that division... Oh my days, could we do the unthinkable and circle all these guys? Oh, we could bloody do that. Get the games and across. Go, 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 my minion. Go, troops. Go, go, go. That would be so many divisions. You, engage. You, engage there. Engage. We got them. Whoa, ho, ho. We got them. Anyways, to Tunis. Oh, that's a lot of divisions. We'll go bye bye here. Damn. See you later. See you later, alligators. Kill them all. 20 divisions in there. Boom. Dead. Right. 16 divisions there. Though, again, Hang's going to really stop us there now. Kind of just, yeah, they're falling apart at the seams, really. That's probably the best way to put it. 
free town is where we want to secure. I don't think we're going to be able to. Let's grab the boys' anti tank rifle. Change you up to aggressive. No real reason to just stand around. Let's get to Niz. Let's go ahead and grab you. We have any airfields in the north? We do. Let's go ahead and send some troops up there. Well, planes rather. They're on their way to secure there. Protector of Tunisia has capitulated. Fantastic. What's the front looking like over here now? Not too shabby at all. Stay you on your journey, boys. There's nobody really stopping you. When you get to Algiers, to Iran. Just want to attack them. Yeah, I think Freetown is going to fall very, very soon. Yep, yeah, just you just go to Casablanca. No, I may have lost 105k, but this is this is fantastically going, it's going fantastically well. Uh, the Germans are collapsing though. That is not a good sign. And their navies will decimate mine. I'm well, saying that. We can actually do this. There we go. We can reduce them. Don't need as many convoys now. Well, we do for transporting troops, but don't need to have all of our dockyards on them. Let's do that. Draw a line up in there. Yeah, push in. But I do want to head out and try and take out the Italians if I can. Landing in Sicily is probably the best way to go about it. Sicily always seems to be the weak underbelly of the Italians. I'm kind of just wanting to land in a spot that's not going to put me into another sea. So if we land there, it's a risky move because it's not ports, but we should be fine. The Italians do only have 33 to 76 divisions. So I don't want the Germans to capitulate. That's going to put us in a very terrible spot, and I don't really want it. The Beijing government has been defeated. Japan is looking hella fine. And Russian Republic is losing. I mean, winning. They are gaining territory as we speak. Onwards we go, men. Onwards we go. Yeah, just get the Casablanca. He'll probably kill them off. French Indochina is holding on by the skin of their teeth. Majors, yeah, it is just these guys to take down. I am not considered a major. Have you seen the damage I have done with 24 divisions? I've almost killed 200k Italians. Ho, ho, ho. Can't wait to land in Sicily. I really hope we'll be able to catch them off guard and start pushing up towards Rome. And that might relieve some pressure on the Germans who are... Uh, they're not having a great time, but they, they may still be okay. They've still got the Poles. The Poles are still there to distract. I'm saying that the Poles aren't a major. As soon as Germany dies, the whole faction's dead. If only we had joined it. Joined that faction. Where's the rest of the divisions? Well, they are on their way. Taking their time, for sure. Just push into them French. Get into them. We'll cut off the port. Oh, look at Africa. Glorious. No, we're still pushing forward. Still doing it. Probably get, need to get the Marrakech as well anyway, so we'll start pushing that division down there. We've secured the port. Good. I think we're just struggling a little bit just because there's a river that we're trying to cross. We've managed to cross it in its entirety near enough. Well, actually, there's a little bit here and a little bit still here, but I think we're going to get across, so it should be fine. Oh, what do we want? Oh, I think some more of you. I think that will do. Then we'll get back onto military. You through there, because we'll be able to hopefully cut some divisions off in the north. 
some of these are still not in position. Get, your move. get, the, get the move on, boys. Yeah, we are starting pushing here because we've actually brought... Those guys are actually arriving. Get the Marrakech. You through there, maybe even walk in behind to get the capital. Gosh, the Germans. How, how much manpower have the French actually got left available on scraping the barrel? Two to four mil. Not great. Not great at all. Um, one to three mil from the Italians. The Czechs are back as well. Well, we're going to have the Strait of Gibraltar under our influence and control in a minute. Casablanca is also going to be under our control, so hopefully that will kill them off. Then we just have to get to Agadir. Oh, Agadir is not actually a port. We need to get to Sendi Infar. Yeah, I knew Marrakech was going to become the capital. I'm actually shocked we're not considered major, but you know, I'm not going to, I'm not going to moan that much about it. I'll maybe moan a couple more times. Yes, Suta is now under our control. Pushing the Marrakech now. Yes, somebody's engaging, pinning them in. We're securing the last port, so these divisions are all dead. Yeah, we just overran some. Agadir is now the capital. The Protectorate of Morocco is gone. All you guys push in on them. Every last one of you is. Come on. Everybody join in the fun here. Yet. Africa is secured, boys. Africa is secured. There we go. Fantastic. Jump back onto there, please. 20 onto there. And four divisions there. Fantastic. There is mines, which is not great. Um, we don't have mine sweepers. Naval invasion support. So what I'll do is select you, bring you to this port. We'll see, we'll see if we can take down the Italians. Anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I shall be back very soon for some more. Till then, take care. Goodbye, then out.